you guys are doing great. So I decided to make room in my freezer. I have my pantry all tore up. I took all my food out of here and I have it in my two pantries on the other side, which I'll show you guys. And trying to figure out what I'm gonna do with this and some stuff behind me. But I wanted to put appliances um, in here or things that we use all the time to clear off my countertop um, that I use all the time. I cannot find a space for like uh, paper plates and the Ninja, the crock pot. I'm trying to think what else I use all the time. I put my bread machine down here so I can get to it um, more accessible. And I always grab, anyway, we'll talk about this later. I always grab these um, Ziploc bags for whatever. So I wanted to fill in the rest of the gaps. Um, I had so much, I enjoyed my time at the meat store. And well, not like that, y'all, but just get in the meats. Um, what I did, I didn't say in the other video, is that I was, I'm going to make this real quick. In the other video, I went through, I, I kind of knew I wasn't replenishing my meats. So, what I did was, <laughs> it was like 1 o'clock in the morning, y'all, and I was getting ready to, you know, watch TV in the room and read my Bible and do some other work and stuff. And I said, you know what? Let me go down here to this freezer. So this freezer that's in here, it's not probably organized to y'all liking, but it's orderly because I took, I had to make a quick inventory and I first started with the pantry on the, not pantry, the freezer on the other side where we eat that pan, that one I got from Sam's that you guys saw. And so I went through that one. I went through this one. I, did, I just jotted down. It wasn't a perfect inventory. And I was like, okay, hope you have vegetables. You have um, like it's some eggs there. You have some fries. You have zucchini. You have waffles, some waffles. You have some fruit. You have some convenience meals, just a few. But I had like maybe some chicken patties from somewhere. Uh, from Sam's, I had two. I had a bag of chicken nuggets. I had two chicken breasts, a couple of pieces of fish. So that's why I made... Not too many meats in that freezer. So that's why I made that trip to the meat market yesterday. And then I wanted to condense my stuff. I wanted to pack it better. Because you know how you're in the freezer and you're kind of making it fumble. It's falling everywhere and stuff is an awkward angle. And you're not utilizing your space. So I knew I didn't do the one in the garage. So I did that right before I went to the meat market to see how much space I could utilize. So I went back. And I was going to spend 20 to $40, but I went ahead and did 60 and I'm done. I think we're good, good. The only thing I don't have is like cube steak. We don't have that all the time, but that's one of my favorite meals. And I didn't even think to get it today at Aldi. But anyway, I think that's the only other meat or roast that I didn't get uh, that I like to have every once in a while. Okay, so I went to the meat market. I'll show you guys what I got there last. But I really wanted to go to Aldi to get this strainer. And this is a collapsible strainer and it pulls out. And I wanted this because I saw this or I read somewhere. I don't remember where y'all, where when you put your spaghetti or something hot down the drain, I'm always draining like ground beef or whatever. So when you put it down the drain, y'all, y'all my sink might not be super clean. Judge it, wash dishes. When you put it down the drain, um, that heat comes back up and someone's, or you know how the water doesn't go all the way down right away in the sink, especially if it's on the garbage disposal side and you definitely don't want to drain on the garbage disposal side with your spaghetti or something and you, that water just fills up. Oh God, I can't remember who posted that, but now I'll catch, now I'm trying to strain something holding the pot, which is dangerous and it's hot and not let the water back up in the sink or let the water or let the strainer just sit. Not necessarily back up, but sit in the sink. That makes sense, y'all. <laughs> and I just been because of the pipe and the heat coming back up, and I've been disgusted ever since. Um, I do clean it sometimes with ammonia or something like that, but I still don't think you get it quite clean. But anyway, y'all. So I got this. It was $9.99. So it can sit on the sides. I used to have one before, but it wasn't collapsible from Aldi. It was a metal one and it just took up too much space. Okay, y'all. So this again is just a stock up to fill in gaps. And I think we're good. And now I can concentrate on the boys' school and what I need to do um 
what I need to do, y'all. <laughs> So I got some more of these um, pork sausage. I saw that I do have two or three in the other big freezer. And we just like to have these, like if we have grits for one night, we crumble it up and like chop it up like hamburger. Instead of like making patties, we just, we just chop it up and put it on top of our grits. Um, also, we have dirty rice. So that's a really quick, easy meal. You can have that just by itself or some bacon bits so you can just have grits by itself y'all you know just being bougie well not bougie that's just my granddaddy was trying to get us to eat grits when i was little so i do the same with my kids which they love grits and so we put bacon crumbles or we put sausage crumbles on top not all the time okay so then i got two of these i'm going to condense this down um and take it out of the package and put it in the freezer bags um, I got some milk. We needed some milk. I really needed to get two gallons, but sometimes when I get two, they don't drink it as fast. They'll drink it fast. It depends if Jason's off or not. Or, yeah, Jason's off or not. So, fruit rounds. I got two of these. I do have one. I think I'm going to get that um, dispenser for the cereal. Jason was talking about it one day, and I was like, oh, you're talking about this, and I just haven't ordered it yet. Um, some Frosted Flakes. I got some Cinnamon Toast Crunch. And some mellow stars. I think we have, there's two cinnamon toast crunch. I think I have some two or three boxes of each one of these somewhere around here. I looked at my sauce before I left and I grabbed some more. Um, I wish I could blink myself to BJ's and back because I like BJ's because they have that, um, is it Taco Bell bulk box that you can buy? And Sam's doesn't carry that. I can order it, but I just, just have them. Okay, by Instacart. So, um, I got one olive oil spray. I don't know why I just got one, but I went in with a list, y'all. I got two of the singles. When I went to Sam's last, I should have got um, some cheese. I know I had cheese here and there. The thing about one of these little cheeses, you can put them in the freezer and you can drop it in your freezer <laughs> in little pockets of the freezer. And sometimes you pull them out, you're like, oh, I got another one. I got another one. So, um, anyway, I got three of the onion powder. Um, I have these things from Better Homes and Gardens, and I'm going to fill them up. And because I cannot, I haven't been able to get the Sam's, I'm going to fill it up. Um, I just cleaned one out that had onion powder in it. So, that's why I have so many. Because I have maybe a few up there already. Um, yellow rice. I like the yellow rice. I think the yellow rice is better than the... Um, one that's in the container jug at Sam's to me. So uh, it wasn't that many left of this. I got six because I usually cook two at a time. And I got two of the real bacon bits. Um, I haven't made it to Sam's to get the big bag. And so that was my substitution. <laughs> I like that bag. Um, they use it for salads. They use it for grits. They use it for, we use it for omelets sometimes. Just some of everything. I wish I can blink myself there. Okay, so I got some caramel coconut fudge cookies. And I, you know, I'm going through their cabinet. I'm moving stuff from the trunks. You see those two trunks there? So the two trunks have, uh, used to have their snacks in it. So I'm moving it to my pantries and I'm putting a lock on the pantry. So I'll show you guys the video and stuff. So this is really for school. And I hope it lasts because I don't really plan on going back um, getting no more. You hear that, JJ? Okay, so I got some peanut butter cookies, too. These were 95 cents. And then I saw these little um, lemon lime mini cakes for 99 cents. So I grabbed those in a chocolate one. I got three of the garlic salt, three of the garlic powder, and the minced onion of the salsa. Um, the medium fresh cut salsa from Aldi. I got two of the honey bread. We haven't eaten a whole lot of bread lately because we still had bread, but I grabbed it anyway. Um, some grapes, some fudge fig bars. I haven't grabbed these in a while. I don't know really why I grabbed them because we have the individual ones, but um, I just wanted to stock up the snacks and then I'm going to, like I said, put the lock on it. I'll show you guys a lot. I got some vanilla sandwich cookies. Jason not going to even know he has these. And I'm going to put them, um, I'm going to put them in the pantry the way he says something. Okay, I also got three of the spaghetti. We have lots of, we have quite much spaghetti left, but I was dwindling, 
it was dwindling down. Um, another thing that I need to get is some Bada Complete Seasoning, but I think I have to go to Food Line to get it or Walmart. So that's really the only thing I need from Walmart other than that I can think off the top of my head. Okay. So I did get some more pork chop. I don't cook a lot of pork chop, but I know when I do, Jason say, oh, I like, but yeah, I don't make a lot of pork chop. And I usually do it like baking it or I will do shake and bake. Yeah, no, no frying. So I'm gonna condense all this down. Um, I didn't get this yesterday. I got some chicken tenders this time. I got two of them. And they're not like super big. It's like 1.14 ounces. They did restart. I didn't take you guys in there today this time. But maybe next time. Uh oh, this one punctured. I got two. No, I got four of the chicken breasts. I love the chicken breasts with the bone in it. Um, especially to cook with because it's more flavorful. Um, we used to have at Kroger 99 cents a pound just about every other week. But now we don't have a Kroger. Um, hair cedar made, but I don't keep up with the sale. Um, I should. Okay, I got four of the ground beef, and I'm gonna condense that down. I did look at this yesterday. I have no business getting this. I don't know if, if these are good, but I know the other red hots are good. So I may have wasted a pig. I don't know. And then I got two more of the stir fry, the pepper strips. I did want to get some more beef stew. But I don't make that all the time either. So I kind of want to try different new things. They do have other things like they have, um, y'all saw in the video. Um, I'll link my video above the previous video. But they have like, you know, the strange stuff. I actually saw some anchovies today, the little fishes. I was like, what is that? Oh, gosh. But I remember I would go into one in Apex years ago. And I'd be printed with Josiah. Not Josiah, JJ. And I'd be about to. Oh, y'all, I'll be about to lose it. My stomach will be so nauseous because of the smell. It wouldn't be terrible. It's just, you know, how you smell every little thing when you're pregnant. And then all looking at all the meats. But I had to go in there and I had to, <laughs> I had to find something to eat for them. And I was just, oh, Jason went for me sometimes, though. Okay, guys, I almost forgot. I did get some paper towels. I like to get these from Aldi. I think they had a larger one. Um, this is the paper towels are more than the toilet paper. This was $6.99, and I like to get this one from Aldi as well. It just lasts longer, y'all, because I know you guys are asking me about the palm toilet paper and stuff. I grew up on this because we um, had a scepter tank in the country when we live in the country, you know, where we live at, sort of like the country tail too. But anyway, we had a scepter tank. So this is why... Um, I was raised on this, so this is fine for us. I know some people like Charmin, the soft stuff, but my kids clog up the tissue. And again, I'm used to this tissue and it lasts longer. I got two of the bleach because I did not realize when I went to Sam's, um, I should have picked up their three pack of bleach. So I got two of those. Um, is that all? Oh, that's my stuff from yesterday. <laughs> I didn't haul it and show you guys because I sat there and forgot and left it in the car. The, um, tub and the pillow that I got from Walmart. Oh, and then I got two of the, no, three of these, and I got two things of water. Just JJ already put it over there on the other side. So that's it. All right. But I'll let you guys go. Thanks so much for the love on the last video. And I'll appreciate you guys for watching as always. Bye-bye.